look at this. We got our 10th load. I know that's not very much, but for as busy as me and Robin have been, that's a lot of loads for us. We've had a lot of stuff going on. I know the guys that have started doing this right around the same time I did, they're probably on 25 or 30 loads already. One thing cool about the app is you can, you can actually see what the other drivers are doing. So you have an idea if you know, you're keeping up with them or if you're like me and not keeping up with them, but that wasn't my plan. It takes a lot of time to video this stuff and video all our stuff for our channel that we do editing, playing with this stuff, moving our fifth wheel to Alabama. We've just been super busy, but you know what? Everything's torqued, air pressures are good, plates on it, hitches installed, all the doors and compartments are locked. This is a baby, this is a baby. So um, I actually took this on purpose because I wanted to see what kind of fuel mileage I get with this truck all in this. We just got here and we averaged 20, 21 miles per gallon all the way here. And then now we're gonna haul this little thing that weighs, I don't know, 5,000 pounds. And I wanna see if this truck gets 15 or 16 hauling this. We'll find out, right? And look who's with me. Hey, Robin. Robin. <laughs> it's William. And Robin. With the Riverstone Life RV Transport. That's a mouthful. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Oh, yes, this is load number 10. <laughs> yeah, you've been on a lot of them. I think I did three or four of them without you. So, probably six for you. But we are on our way to Harrisburg, PA. And the reason, Pennsylvania. The reason we're doing that is because Robin has <laughs> doctor's appointment. I hope I get my yeah, stents. Better because you've been rough the last two days. I've been miserable. Miserable. She's been miserable the last two days. Well, you know what? You can see me bouncing. Try to bounce when you have That's a steroid. You're taking antibiotics for the last three weeks. That's a steroid, so you know what kind of rage this woman has. <laughs> I'm innocent. <laughs> well, anyways, <laughs> the load that we picked up, we picked it up and it was right underneath the um, toll road, right? Yeah. Indiana toll road. And you know, if you watch my other videos, I don't do toll roads. So Robin's like, you know what, since we're doing this video for other people, maybe we should do the toll road just for the experience. I said, I'll do it this once. <laughs> and she said, it's right there and we'll be there and an hour saves quicker. saves us an hour. It saves us an hour. that makes my life happy right now. Yeah, but as of right now, I can tell you that I have to turn in this on the bill when I deliver this. And so far, the only, only one of the tolls is showing up. Right. So I'm not sure if you're going to get paid right away or how that's going to work. Because um, I don't do tolls. But anyways, we get on this road. And the first, what would I say, maybe a mile or so, it was like magical. Smooth sailing. I'm like, this is great because he's not going to yell. I'm not going to be all miserable because I'm going to do a toll road. I want to do a toll road. I said, do a toll road. And I was so excited. I'm like, yes, I got this one. It backfired, didn't it? <laughs> and 10 minutes later, we've been bouncing, bouncing, bouncing. For an hour or so. An hour? Road, oh my God, it was longer than an uh, hour. The whole damn ride. The, the road was the worst I've ever horrible. been on. It was horrible. Yeah, and I don't understand how you have to pay to be on something that's even worse. No, it makes no sense. Yeah, it makes it's no ridiculous. sense. So, you know, avoid that. I, 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 me, I'd rather have the extra hour taking the back road. I would have too. I'm more of a happier person. <laughs> I thought 60 he, minutes less would make my life less miserable. The other thing that is backfired. that toll road was so narrow when you had to get through some of the areas that yeah. I mean you have to pay, even the semis I some of them I thought they were gonna hit stuff, you know. Yeah. So you know Well so I've you, never been on. I've never yeah, ever well, been on Indiana's Indiana toll yeah. or Ohio's. Yeah, so if you're gonna start doing the toll roads because they make you buy that easy pass and right. Have it, it all hooked up and it works. It I worked fine. Sure it worked. it, it actually opened the gate and let us through yeah. and everything, so it worked. Um, and the road sucks. Yeah, the road was really bad. And, you know, and that's all right if you you know if you're gonna drive that run straight through. The hour we could, you know it makes it easier because it was eight hours and something, so you'd easily be easily be yeah, able the to deliver. Yeah, awesome. You better deliver it so if you left first sucks. thing in the morning. You better do that. Yeah. Um, ours didn't work that way because we picked it up late and we were just gonna yeah, drive half the way and then. We're gonna sleep in this, but Robin was just in too rough of shape. So I found a $79 hotel 
just lucky. I just pulled off the roll, pulled in there. <laughs> this is how bad it was. We pull in there and there's a cracker barrel. This cracker barrel in Youngstown? Youngstown, Ohio. So if you guys are in Youngstown and you're looking for, for a place to stay, the cracker barrel in Youngstown, right off 80, has like 20 spots yeah, for RVs great. and nobody was there. And I'm like, we could just stay right here. But she's like, she's like, I really need a bed tonight. I'm like, okay. So I just get on my phone and I got to stay at the hotel right well, there. Well, you know, if we would have went to like perhaps a gas station prior to you dropping me off at Cracker Barrel, I'm a female. I have things that I need to do. Yeah, I know. I have, I travel with distilled water, William. Yeah, she I need this because I need to irrigate my nose a lot every day for the next I'm sure, I'm months. sure these people watching so, this don't want to know that, Robin. <laughs> well, I'm just saying it's a little inconvenient right now for me to be whipping out this on the side of a Cracker Barrel parking lot. And it's actually yeah. gross because we were picking the trailer up and she says, you got to go buy a gas station. I said, you know what, just do it out here in the... Because oh, I don't want no, these people to I see this. I don't want people to see. My nose is healing. It's bad. It's bad. So, so this is my new friend for the next three months. Whoops. I caught it. Look at that. Good job. But anyways, the toll road oh, sucked, right? Yes. Toll road sucked. We haven't got paid. We haven't gotten the bill yet. Yeah, I got so half the bill, so I don't know how that's going to work out. We'll put that into another video on how easy that is. Or if you've done this before, um, leave it in the comments to help the other guys out because I get a lot of guys talking to me lately that are starting this, new classes and everything. Yeah, how fun. Yeah, and they keep Look thanking us for you know helping them out and a lot of this stuff I don't know and I know there's guys out there that know this stuff if they just want to help them out. We're learning as we go. Yeah, and uh, but it's been a fun experience. So, but the question, the question, the question in this video. Is, yes, the question. See, we kind of started this video backwards. You yeah. decided to put in the spiel of picking it up, which will be, which was in the beginning of the yeah. video, and now we're on day two. And what is the miles per? You know, we <laughs> the worst we've got with this trailer was 9.3, and that was last night. Bad wind. Rain. Hard, hard, hard yeah. rain, and it was Happy nine weather. three. Yeah. Now today I've been averaging like 10, 10, 10 and a half, but I've been running seventy mile an hour because I want to get this dropped off, get back to your parents' house, get ready for tomorrow because I got to yeah, drive to Philly excited tomorrow. So. For tomorrow. Yeah. So um, I, this thing really is not doing as good as I thought it would do. No, you are totally off. Yeah, I was totally off. So another another learning yeah. experience, just because it's small and I, I don't know if it's just the the shape of it is what. Is causing it to be so right. bad because I can grab a that fifth wheel, that Cougar fifth wheel that we hauled all the way out to Maine. That was Maine? a they're not Maine. We hauled to Washington. Bronx, yeah, Bronx, yeah I, I don't know. But anyways, we hauled it all the way out to Washington, <laughs> and that thing was like 37 foot, and that thing got 12 miles per gallon. You know, and I just think it was huge. It was huge, and I think the fifth wheels, the way the front of the fifth wheels are designed, I think it just or maybe it cuts the wind, comes yeah, off the. Yeah, I don't know, know, but but smaller. Smaller, yeah, it, it, did, it didn't work because <laughs> we hauled that 37 foot travel trailer all the way to Hamburg, is that where it was? When yes. we went to the Cabela's, yeah, yeah, yeah. that thing got like 12 miles per gallon. Isn't that crazy, yeah, that big thing. And we had pretty much the same kind of weather, yeah. So I was wrong about this, but I did this just for a learning lesson. So just because, and I also did it because the Robin was going with me, and she thinks smaller is better. Well, I, I feel less scared because I can actually see. And there's a fifth wheel for the next run. And I'm it doesn't feel like wheel. there's anything behind us. That's what I like. Because I don't know how. No. I don't know how piece. I can haul this thing and get worse fuel mileage than I do haul the Riverstone. It's weird, isn't it? Yeah, 43 foot Riverstone, 19,160 pounds, fully loaded, <laughs> and it gets the worst it's ever got is 10 and a half, and this little thing has got 9.3. So if you clicked on the video just to see what the fuel mileage was, it wasn't like I thought it would be. <laughs> nope. But it is nice though when I got my auxiliary tank and I was able to fill the auxiliary no, tank. You didn't have to go through a gas. Yeah, anymore. I filled it up in, in Alabama where the fuel was a lot, lot cheaper, like 350. Yeah, and I didn't even have to use a fuel cart or nothing. And I knew that. And then when I got here, I was able to top the first tank off. And then we hooked to this and then we were able to do our whole run, deliver this and go to your parents' house for you know like 140 bucks even with the bad fuel mileage yeah so the whole trip we're gonna have 140 dollars expenses we're gonna have 80 little bit like 87 dollars with taxes and everything for a hotel so yeah you know 140 that's 227 228 dollars take away 935 so we still make good money you know it, for all the days working. yeah i mean it's 
a day's work for us because by the time when we started last night and by the time we're done today, it's we started late. Yeah, we just we did it. I drove a lot in the dark a lot last night, so but it's still it's still it's one day. It just you know we did it half of yesterday. Half of today. <laughs> And I know somebody's gonna say, I oh, didn't do it Monday. <laughs> all right, well, whatever. I made more than 350 bucks. So even if I take off all, if I throw away $300 into the savings account for wear and tear, yeah. I still made more than 350 in profit. All right, just remember folks, you look at it how you wanna look at it and I look at it how I wanna look at it. Correct. Yeah, I got, I got paid to drive her to her doctor's appointment. Yes. That's how I'm looking at this. So, and that's how I have to justify this sometimes is, we're gonna go where we want to go. Yes. See who we want to see. Do what we want to do. Whatever adventure, and we're gonna to try to let this stuff pick up. That's the plan. And it did it the first go around, and I'm hoping this next two weeks that we're out here, we can make it happen again. Yeah. All right. So you got anything else to add to this, Robin? Before I shut it down. <laughs> no, my face hurts. Her face hurts, and I'm tired. So <laughs> just remember, if you like the video, give us a thumbs, thumbs up. up. If you like what we're doing on the channel, subscribe to the channel, and us some comments bad or good because it makes the video go viral <laughs> oh i don't say viral it gets it out there it gets it out there <laughs> and always